What it do, y'all? It is me, K-Star. This message is going to be for my Libras, okay? How are we balancing out in life after that retrograde? Oh, for my Libras, Sun, Moon, Rising, and, and Venus, this message for you. Those of you who are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. Hopefully, this resonates with all. And if you are new, please feel free to like, share, comment, and definitely hit the subscribe button, okay? Um, and a notification bell so that every time I post, um, you are notified, okay? Um, also, too, what did I want to say? Um, that I'm working with one eye, y'all. So, <laughs> I damaged my left, my right eye. So, the king of wands is the bottom of the deck. Um, I damaged my right eye. So, basically, um... It's hard for me, like, to really focus on what I'm doing right here, like, to see the card. So, if I pause, it's because I'm trying to focus. And if I also pause, too, usually it's because I'm getting a download, okay? So, and I would I would normally say that if I'm getting a download, so you would know. So, um, also, too, those of you who have given me the opportunity to do a reading i really really appreciate that it's an honor to do that so um if you have a reading was this the one i wanted to use i don't think this is the one i wanted to use if um this is not the card i wanted to use so um yeah if you would like to have a reading just post uh the information will be right below the video and also to a donation. Hold on, right, se right one second, because this is not the um, deck I want to use. Just one second. Back to the lecture at hand. Yeah, the information will be right below the video. And you know the disclaimer. If the shoe fits, wear that shit. And if it doesn't apply, let it fly, Cinderella, okay? Don't try to fit in where you, where you don't get in, okay? But the message is not for you. The message is just not for you, okay? Um. So, yeah, I'm going to pull from... <laughs> See how I'm trying to put the box together? The Spellbound Oracle deck. Okay, and three cards, Holy Spirit, for the Spellbound Oracle deck for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. So what I am seeing here, Libra, we have the King of Wands here in reverse. Okay, mm, you, some of you could be dealing with someone who <laughs> you lost passion for them, or this person is not showing um, any type of emotions towards you. Like there's no love there. Like you're no longer looking at this person as a king. But then you got the Ten of Swords here in reverse. You have learned a lesson about dealing with this type of energy. You don't want any type of new um, beginnings with this individual. No matter what they offer you, you don't want it. This is more than likely... Um, a separation or a breakup right now you got the two of cups here in reverse and the lover's card here in reverse so you could be dealing with um a gemini reconciliation they want to re reconcile with you you could be dealing with a gemini or um a water sign pisces cancer scorpio um the four of cups here someone missed an opportunity okay career show damn career showed up for you too as well libra okay so i feel like some of you gonna do a um a shift um change and then that here is the eight of cups here i feel like some of y'all are in the mode of you really just don't know what to do or how to leave this situation i feel like you've been in this situation for so long um this eight of i'm sorry this is the eight of coins you're not wanting to work on that i told y'all i had to focus it's the eight of coins here okay um, you just don't want to work on this anymore, okay? You feel like you, you're feeling overwhelmed with this situation. You just don't even want to take anything from this person. Basically, Libra, with this individual, you're just really holding back. You're not giving your cup. Some, like I said, some of you are still in this situation with this person. Good luck, okay? 
Luck is on your side right now, Libra. Let's let's also take from the wisdom deck. Hold on, y'all. I got a lot of shit going on here. Let's take from the wisdom deck. That's this is what I'm getting here. Um I feel like for some of you too, this person always come to you for money and assistance. Like they just don't have their shit together, okay? Um there's no balance with this relationship is what I'm getting. Okay. Well, you also, to this king of wands, could be a fire sign as well, Libra. Um, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay. Could be a fire sign or Leo. Okay. Pull three more cards from the wisdom deck. Libra, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. You got individuality, okay. You got the high priestess of water, okay, and you have vision, okay. What I'm seeing here with this whole um spread here on um, Libra, this is basically a spread of I feel like transformation because you got good luck here, reconciliation, which we are going to um get into that i don't feel like it's somebody new it could be but i'm just getting the sense that this is someone who um you are already dealing with but for some of you too like this king of wands here has basically um could have ghosted you as well or you have could have stopped it all communication with this person but you're holding back okay with the four of cups here because i feel like with this four of cups here this person was really toxic um just like a lot of urgent um overindulgence like this person really just didn't have any type of balance i feel like this person had you in a third party situation and you were just basically feeling like dealing with this individual this was not anything out of love okay um you felt like um this is like that unrequited love um you were given and they were just taken okay um any type of thing, anything that they're coming to you for any type of assistance, Libra, you just don't want to deal with this individual, period. That's what I'm getting. Let's clarify this King of Wands here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus Spirit. Why is this King of Wands here in reverse for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? I also feel like at one time y'all did separate and you took this person back. Okay, and then you broke up again. But like I said, I feel like I I feel like some of you, you know, this is just you're just holding back. All the the only on card here that is upright is this four of cups. Okay. And this is you. And I feel like this person also too has type of some type of addiction um issue too as well. Um, Spirit also is telling me that some of you also need to go and get like blood work done. Just check up on yourself. Nothing bad. Some of you could be feeling like really tired lately. It could be dealing with anemia, um, um, a vitamin deficiency. Okay. Um, some of you are not putting on weight. This could also be dealing with stress too. Okay. Okay. So the King of Wands here in reverse. Holy Spirit. Why is this King of Wands here in reverse? What is the lack of passion here? The unattachment. Why is this for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? Okay. You got this here, the Nine of Pentacles. Because, um, Libra, you just want to be single. You don't want to invest in this individual. This Ten of Swords. What is this clarity? Hold on. You just want to be single. You're tired of this person's shenanigans. I mean, Libra, basically, you could do all this stuff on your own. Why in the world should you carry somebody else's baggage? I mean, like, you're just tired of giving to this individual, tired of giving to the situation. Holy Spirit, why is a Ten of Swords here in reverse? What is this clarity about? There's no more victimization here. You're done. You're done with all the daggers in your bag, okay? They can't put any more daggers. They can't cut you any more deep than they have. And this is why you're holding back. Okay, um, the, the Ten of Swords here reverse the Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. Yep, the Three of Wands here because you know basically there is no planning for this individual. There's nothing here. Messages, um, I'm getting a sense that some of you may even be waiting for a message for this person. A message is not coming in, or they're waiting for you to message them. 
and you're just not responding here. And this is why the Ten of Wands is him reversed. It's like you're you you you're shutting down. You 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 Libra. You basically shut down communication with this individual. And if you are still residing with this person, and I feel like some of you may be do, may still live with this individual. Um, you're not communicating the way you used to. I mean, you are really holding back your emotions. Why is the Ace of Coins here? And you're holding back your money too. Four of coins, I mean, the eight of coins here and the ace of coins here. I'm just here like this person's not going to take from, from me no more. Why is this ace of coins here in reverse for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in, Venus, and in Venus? Why is this ace of coins here in reverse for Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? Yeah, because the king of pentacles, this person is unstable. It was unstable with their finances. Do not how to keep a home afloat. Holy Spirit, what is this two of cups here in reverse? Okay. What is this separation or this breakup? This two of cups here in reverse. Got a lot of reversals here. What is this two of cups here in reverse, Holy Spirit? But I feel, Libra, you know, you are on the... um on your throne okay you can make shit happen without this person spirit want me to tell you this uh what is the two of cups in reverse for Libra, sun moon rising and in venus dang you got the lover's card here in reverse too again wow maybe you guys have taken this person back um Oh, numerous numerous of times and you just have had it you just can't take this person back anymore i feel like maybe you have forgiven this person because in order for the lover's card and the two of cups the lover's cards again to be in reverse i feel like you have given this multiple chance okay and this is why the eight of coins is like enough is enough when enough is enough holy spirit what is this um lover's card here in reverse what is this lover's card here in reverse holy spirit for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. Shoot, I can't even shuffle the deck. What is this lover's card here in reverse? For Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. Damn, the Nine of Cups here. Not getting your wish fulfilled, okay? They did not bring anything to the table, so you basically had to leave. The Four of Cups, Holy Spirit. Why is the four of cups here? So you just want to be single because this person wasn't wasn't bringing shit to the table. Why is the four of cups here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? You're tired of giving away your cups. Why is the four of cups here for um, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? Holy Spirit. The moon card because secrets came out. Things were revealed. Things that you found out, some shit had basically scared you because you was like, damn, I can't believe this type of individual, okay? But I feel like the secrets came out, you know, a lot. You could be dealing with the Pisces or a Cancer. When a moon card here is in reverse, this this also could be a person feeling like um, very confused, um, anxiety, fear. I feel like the fear is that you found out like a lot of shit. Let me tell you. Most of the readings that I'm about to post, a lot of people have discovered a lot through this retrograde, okay? You found out about a lot. I feel like, now that I'm looking at this, I feel like you have found out that this person could possibly have had a home with somebody else. The Two of Cups. I'm getting a sense, like, as if though, um, okay, I'm getting a sense, um, Libra, that for some of you, your person could have been having a double life with someone else. This is also, too, could be a reason why um, the lover's card are coming out like this. This person had a lot of entanglements, okay? And this is some shit that you, was, that, that you have discovered, okay? Um, yeah, some of y'all were waiting on the messages or they are waiting on messages from you. But I feel like you're not giving any type of contact with this individual. Okay, they're going to sit there and wait for a long time because you're not going to contact. I honestly feel you're just not going to go back to this. And this is why you have the Eight of Coins here. Holy Spirit, Father God, please clarify the Eight of Coins here in reverse for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. Why is the Eight of Coins here in reverse for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus?
Why is the Eight of Coins here in reverse for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? The Eight of Coins here in reverse. <laughs> why it's in reverse? I'm going to read you why it's in reverse. You are a badass being full of life, love, and possibilities through the through this debt. May you find a path to your best self. Yeah, you've had your breakthrough. This situation that you're dealing with, this individual um, cause you to go through your breakthrough and you've seen a lot you've discovered a lot you want to be single you're no longer going to give into this anymore i feel like you give this person multiple chances i feel like this person has entanglements um they're always in a damn relationship or you're with someone this individual here who you're dealing with this person always have a backup to the backup so when shit go wrong with one they got one to scoop them up and pick them up but i'm getting a sense that somebody here not only have you left this individual um and not invested into it i'm getting the sense that the person also who they're with now that is crumbling as well okay let's um look into this reconciliation i want to do this first um let me see I wonder if I should. Well, damn. Okay, here it is. Nope, once again, that is not the one that I wanted. Where is that deck? Hold on, y'all, one second. I'm sorry, y'all, for having to break like that. But when you're working with one damn eye, um, when you're working with one eye, it's like I could have sworn I picked up this deck and I didn't. Okay, so let's let's go into this reconciliation. Okay, this reconciliation. What what is this message is here? This person's gonna be. Is, I guess apparently that they're very sorry. You know, um, you're not communicating with them. You're not. Uh, dealing with them like you used to and they're sorry but you're just tired of giving them all the chances Libra okay so we're gonna see from um the unspoken messages exactly um what are they thinking okay it's for Libra Sun Moon Rising and in Venus Holy Spirit this reconciliation what is on this person's mind okay what are they thinking right now You still haunt me. Damn. Because I feel like this individual know that they did some fucked up shit. Okay. Um, you still haunt me. I think that they are battling with everything that they have done to you. The secrets that were found out, they're battling. Okay. With that. But, I mean, hold on. Let me see what's the next one. Can't sleep with you on my mind. Okay. When it's gone, it's gone. It's nothing that you can think, do about it. Let me see. What's another one? You got a lot of... They saying one step at a time. Okay one step at a time so this person wants to come in and reconcile with you um, i'm gonna also say to libra check your friendship um you some of you have somebody in your circle that just don't like the fact that they feel that libra got it all a very jealous spirit i'm getting this i'm getting this down low now check that individual Check that person. Check the messages that they receive from you. Don't really believe all the messages that you're getting from that person. Um, this also could be with this Nine of Pentacles here in reverse and this King of Wands. Like, just be mindful of the interaction you may have with this so-called friend is what I'm seeing. Okay? 
that's what I'm getting here. Let's look in as far as um career. What's going on in career? What do I want to use? I just use another the good witch. Holy Spirit, Father God. Yeah, but um, remember when I was reading this card here, you are a bad, badass. I feel like, Libra, that some of you are just realizing, you know, listen, I got to move on with life. All this shit, I don't want to entertain. Okay, so as far as the career-wise, let's see. So like I said, some of you are going to be changing careers, okay? Um, you're just going to be doing things for the better, okay? So just to know that your person do want to reconcile or somebody from the past want to reconcile with you. But you know how I feel about taking those folks back, okay? Um, don't be in a fantasy land, okay? Because this person more than likely still have a lot of options and they do want to communicate, okay? Quickly, okay? They do want to communicate. Let's go on with this career, Holy Spirit, Father God. As far as Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus. What's going on with this career? On the Five of Pentacles, yes, yeah, some, some of you are going to be stepping into something new, okay? Um, starting a new life, okay? No longer out in the cold, working out on, working for yourself, the ending. Yeah, you're going to end something. So some of you are going to be walking away from a job um, and um, because this job no longer serves you. You're now on the plight of um, just finding things that make you happy now. You're done with all the confusion and everything. So this is basically just an inner reflection like, okay, now I know the truth. Now I must move on. Okay. Um, let's see about the good luck card here. Notice it's like it's a lot of green here. Okay. It's a lot of greenery here. So let's see. Good luck card here. What do you want to tell? See the ace of wands here and you are releasing the burdens. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Okay. So it's new beginnings. Good luck. Okay, you have good luck on your side, um, Libra. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus, Holy Spirit. There's a card here. What do you want to tell us about Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and in Venus? These look now. You got the Knight of Wands here too. Basically, what this is saying to me, um. Uh, what I'm feeling that this is saying, Libra, is that the good luck is going to come when you just make this ghost and you just don't entertain this. You know, the Knight of Wands, the energy in the reverse. And I also feel to the King of Wands, the King of Wands could be a playboy or it's just that you are just not putting no more time into it. The Knight of Wands, too, um, could be someone who you're just not giving um, any energy to being ghosted. Um, and for some of you, Spirit want me to tell you that if this person has ghosted you, th the luck is on your side with this, okay? Don't try to open that door. The, the purpose for, for you to move on is maybe Spirit had went and gave this person the sense and the time on it, moment of just not to contact you. Whatever this energy is, um, and it's not being away from you and it's not dealing with you, it's, it's on your side. It's for your benefit is what I'm getting, okay? I mean, look at all that greenery. That is abundance. And with the king here, it's basically like you was making this individual a king. You was really assisting this person. Okay? So now that person I went to king tonight status, it's good luck that you are not communicating and dealing with them. Okay? Give me one more card for that. Yep. Because look, dealing with that individual, the will of fortune in reverse. Okay, not good luck. See how you got good luck here? Okay, you got good luck here for you as long as you're not entertaining this and this stay ghosted. The minute you open up that door, this is the this person only bring the wheel of fortune in reverse type of energy. It's nothing good coming out of this. The high priestess of water here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, yes, Fall, go through your in your um your intuition. Your vision, what you see for yourself. Don't let no one throw you off track, okay? Even as far as career-wise. This could be something practicing into spirituality. Be an individual, okay? Know how to stand out. Don't try to sit. Don't try to fit into a, 
uh, conforming to like a particular box that, you know, you need to be like everybody else, Libra. No, that is not the case. Libra, how you going to stand out and how you going to have this luck and this blessing on your side is by you standing out with everything. Okay, but I want to reiterate, and for some of you here, with this Nine of Pentacles here in reverse and this King of Wands, the, 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 the key to you moving forward is ghosting this person. Cut off all contacts. Okay, so with that being said, I am Cancer. I am Cancer. <laughs> oh my God, I am a Cancer though. I am K-Star. And remember, every ending is a beautiful beginning. And I will see you next time.